What's good YouTube? It's Aquarius Abound ABB the Prophecy um I've been thinking about how a lot of people are saying that um oh if you're new to my channel please um hit I'm I mean if you're new to my channel please comment hashtag new um but anyway so uh, this is gonna be a quick video um there's a lot of people saying that um how the uh how the um how the houston rockets are not really contenders um I mean, I think they play in great basketball sometimes when they want to. Um, when they want to, they want to play. When they want to play great basketball, they could be the best of them. And when they don't want to play basketball, you see how they got technically blown out against the Orlando Magic, who's fighting for that eighth spot. Um, and I think they they lost against the Clippers. Uh, a few games back, a few days back ago. So, um, you know, I always say this. Uh, if you want to go small, that means that, you know, it's a high, no tempo, you know, fast-paced type of style. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know, because usually the center is just there to grab rebounds and block shots, you know, and putbacks. Um, but since... There's no center. It's easy, you know. That's how it's easy for you know anybody to you know bank it in the paint. You know what I'm saying? Uh, it's kind of like how the Warriors didn't have a center. You know, Zaza. They didn't really consider the Zaza Pachulia a center. Uh, you know, um, and then they had Javel McGee and they had Bogut. Bogut was a center, uh, but obviously, you know, he, you know, wanted, I think he wanted the max deal, and then they said no, so he went somewhere else, but uh, I think the combination of Westbrook and Harden sometimes, it, 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 it rubs me the wrong way. Um, I think they're very fun to watch, but they're never going to win a championship. Never going to win a championship. You know, uh, it reminds me when Carmelo Anthony and Allen Iverson first hooked up in Denver. Um, you know, I knew it was not going to work. Uh, you know, they ball-centric. You know, Melo wants the ball in his hands a lot. And, you know, I mean, and Melo was on the come-up. And, you know, Iverson was a little bit on a decline, you know. Um, but still, you know, to see those two in the same team, yeah, it didn't really mesh well. You know, the chemistry was just off. You know, um, so I don't really expect the Rockets to go far in the playoffs. Yes, they will make the playoffs. Is this if they stop shooting themselves in the foot and stop losing these games that they should win? Because there's games where they look like they could beat the Lakers. Right in a seven game series, I'm just saying like they they're it's like they show flashes where they can you know beat the best of them, you know what I'm saying? Um, but they also flow show they also show flashes where you know they're very vulnerable, and you know they can either like a team could go big on them and you know it, it's basically over because they. They all got players that's under seven feet tall. You know what I'm saying? Like, everybody's six foot, you know, except for Eddie. Well, yeah, everybody's six foot. So, it's easy for anybody to just go big on them and, you know, put two centers in the, you know, on the floor and it's over. You know what I'm saying? Like, they're going to have to outshoot the other opponent, which Russell Westbrook is not even a great shooter. Let's just get it just out the way. Westbrook is not really a great shooter. James Harden, he could get hot, but he can he can he can he can he, uh, can he um sustain it f 
for a um, long period of time. Um, you know, I don't know. I don't know, but it's going to be fun to watch. You know, uh, this game, I mean, I hope the Rockets don't get swept. <laughs> I hope the Rockets don't get swept. But if they do, then, I mean, hey, they face a great opponent, right? Um, you know, like, you know, I don't know. I don't know, this team just scratches your head. Like, it just, you know, this team, you know, not my team, but, I mean, obviously, um, I mean, if y'all new to my channel, um, I am a New York Knicks fan. So, yeah, uh, I'm just stating if y'all, if y'all, if y'all Houston Rockets fans, then, um, you know, I think, you know, y'all just need to win the matches. Y'all just need to win the games. Y'all, y'all have to win, you know, and lose to the teams y'all have to lose to. But don't lose to the Knicks. Don't lose to the, to the, to the, to the, to the Hawks. You know what I'm saying? Like, teams you should beat, you should beat. The teams that you can't beat, then... I mean, you can't really beat yourself up because, you know, it is what it is. They're just too, uh, they just too dominant. But, um, like I said again, I do believe that the Rockets will make the playoffs. Uh, I think they'll probably make it as the fourth seed or the fifth seed. Um, but they're not going to go far. Um, unless they require a, a, a center next year or you know if Anthony did I mean there's I mean there could be as a possibility that Anthony Davis leaves LA because he only signed a one-year deal you know what I'm saying so what does that tell you you know like Anthony Davis could have came to LA said you know what I'm a LeBron James signed a four-year deal okay I'm gonna I'm sign the five-year deal because he's still young at the AD is still what he's only what 20, 26 years old. He's still young, you know. So if LeBron James signed a four year deal, AD could have signed a five year deal or probably a four year deal. But no, because he knew that the close he knows he knew he knows that the 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 window is closing. You know, and you know. Like I said again, if LeBron James can 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 do it once again, because he has done it, you know, like a lot of people might say, oh well, you know, um, um, the Warriors were shorthanded that year, you know, Draymond Green got suspended, you know, did it and that. Look, Draymond Green is sorry. Okay, I never liked Draymond Green. You know, uh, I think Draymond Green is like one of those. Players that you can easily exploit by putting him on a weak team and expecting him to carry that team. You know what I'm saying? Which he can't because he's not that superstar. You know, he's just a big rope. He's just a big guy, a, a, a big role player. You know what I'm saying? He's just a role player. That's all he is. You know, they just groomed him into a big superstar or star. You know what I'm saying? Because he's a great defender. He's not a great defender. He never was. <laughs> Kicking people in the nuts is not a great defender. Being a great defender, you know? Like, if he's, if it, like, if Draymond Green was on that Scottie Pippen level, then okay, but he's not, obviously. And if he was on that Dennis Robin level, which he's not, okay, I would get it, but, I mean, he always like the the way he shoots is like he has he always has a backpack on like he's trying to <laughs> take that bitch off and try to shoot with it. But anyways, um, yeah, the Rockets ain't gonna go far. Um, you know, I mean, I think they could win a game. I mean, I don't think they're gonna get swept, but I think they can win a game or two. Um, uh, so yeah, uh, tell me what you think. Will the Rockets? Probably get out the first round. Will they get swept? All right. Um, if you haven't already, if anybody's new, or you know, if have any, if anybody's watching this, uh, please hit that like button, subscribe to my channel. Until next time, take care of yourself and each other. Peace.